anyone playing the game World of Warcraft as druids, death knights, warlocks, could also have another designation, surveillance targets. According to newly disclosed classified documents, the NSA and its British counterpart have been infiltrating World of Warcraft, another online game called Second Life, and the Xbox Live console. They've gathered metadata, according to the documents, but also used human spies to go undercover and create their own avatars, make-believe characters, so they could interact with possible terrorists playing games. The documents were obtained by the Guardian newspaper from NSA leaker Edward Snowden and shared with the New York Times and ProPublica. Why did the NSA do this? E.J. Hilbert once chased gaming cyber criminals for the FBI. In the online gaming world, you can communicate openly between two characters and this is not something that goes over the line it is in a it's in a smaller group you can also gift money in the form of gold or characters or online currency and conceivably terrorists could plan real attacks through these fantasy games experts say the fake identities voice and text chat capability the ability to speak to others in real time are all features of gameplay that terrorists find attractive. But the NSA's spying program raises privacy concerns. It's a privacy violation because the people who are participating in these gaming worlds think of the game interactions as ephemeral. I mean, you're, you participate in the game, it disappears, you don't know who the characters are, everything is fantasy. And if it turns out that, in fact, the government is routinely storing all of that activity analyzing it, linking it up to actual individuals with known identities, then I think people would be concerned. And according to The Guardian and The Times, with all those elves, trolls, and gnomes being surveilled, there's no indication of any terrorists caught or plots foiled. Contacted by CNN, the NSA would not comment on the reports or the privacy complaints. It did say that its foreign intelligence mission is centered on, quote, valid foreign intelligence targets. A spokesman for the NSA's British counterpart would not confirm or deny the reports, but said that agency's activities are necessary and legal. Xbox maker Microsoft and the maker of World of Warcraft say they're not aware of any surveillance and they wouldn't have given permission for it. The maker of Second Life has not commented. Wolf.